poets and playwrights of the Renaissance were not professional writers as we understand that today. They were courtiers, noblemen, amateurs in the art of letters. Yet, their contributions to literature were monumental. They laid the groundwork of modern English poetry and prose, a legacy that endures today. Imagine a world where every book is a rare treasure, hand-copied with painstaking effort. This was the reality before a groundbreaking invention transformed the fabric of society. The printing press. This story begins around 1450 in Mainz, Germany, with the invention of a movable type press set by Johannes Gutenberg. This moment marked a great revolution in Renaissance information technology, comparable to the emergence of the internet today. While historians recognize the printing press as a revolutionary invention, its immediate economic impact was not clearly reflected in measures of productivity or income. This presents a puzzle akin to the early impact of computer technology on macroeconomic productivity. By 1500, about 200 of over 1,000 historic European cities had established printing presses. These presses were not just technology, but also hubs of economic ideas, driving the growth of modern cities. Cities that embraced printing technology without any prior growth advantage subsequently grew much faster than those without. The adoption of the printing press was associated with a substantial population growth advantage from 1500 to 1600. The effect of the introduction of print media to cities is almost immeasurable. It led to positive spillovers in human capital and technological innovation it created a culturally dynamic environment, increased labor value, and attracted migrants seeking opportunity. In a pre-industrial world where commerce was key to urban wealth, print media was instrumental in skill development for merchants. It also played a role in the spread of advanced business practices and literacy, paving the way for the rise of new professional classes like merchants, lawyers, and teachers. The printing press also stands as one of history's most transformative inventions. Its impact resonates through centuries, paving the path for the spread of knowledge, economic growth, and the rise of a more informed and interconnected world. It also brought about the spread of the modern university in Europe. The Renaissance was a vibrant period in European history, marked by a profound transformation in scientific understanding and exploration as a result of the printing press and other new technological innovations. In the Middle Ages, science was heavily influenced by classical and Christian thought. Matter was believed to be composed of four elements, earth, air, fire, and water. The cosmos was envisioned as a concentric sphere with a static earth at the center. But these beliefs were about to change. Human health was considered a balance of four humors. This period was also rife with belief in magic, witchcraft, and the influence of heavenly bodies on human events. The Renaissance ushered in a paradigm shift. Heliocentric, mechanistic, and mathematical conceptions began to emerge, led by luminaries such as Copernicus, Harvey, Kepler, Galileo, and Newton. This period saw the gradual erosion of Aristotle's authority and the resurgence of ancient Greek scientific works, which greatly expanded knowledge in various disciplines. In mathematics, the Renaissance made significant strides, with humanists integrating arithmetic and geometry into the liberal arts curriculum. 
artists explored geometrization of space and figures like Leonardo da Vinci recognized the world's rule by numbers. The translation and publication of Archimedes' works marked a notable contribution to mathematics. In technology, the Renaissance was a period of great achievement. Advances in warfare, town planning, and a preoccupation with alchemy, the precursor to chemistry, were stimulated by social needs and limitations of traditional cosmology. Not only was the way in which we see the cosmos changing during the Renaissance, the role of women underwent a subtle but significant evolution as well. While it's true that the era was marked by remarkable achievements in art, science, and culture, it's also important to recognize the often overlooked contributions of women during this period. In a society where traditional gender roles were deeply entrenched, women faced numerous challenges. They were expected to excel in the domestic sphere, managing households and raising children. Yet beneath the surface, there was a quiet revolution happening. Renaissance women, particularly those of noble or wealthy families, began to have access to more education and the arts. They embraced literature and philosophy, and some even became patrons of the arts themselves. Women like Isabella d'Este, a prominent figure in the courts of Renaissance Italy, not only supported artists and scholars, but also played active roles in politics and diplomacy. However, it's essential to acknowledge that the opportunities for women remained limited compared to men during this period. While a few exceptional women managed to break through societal barriers, the majority still faced restrictions on their ambitions and independence. The Renaissance was a time of contrasts and contradictions for women. On the one hand, there was an increasing recognition of their intellectual capability and talent. On the other, the prevailing social norms of patriarchal structures continued to suppress their potential. As our journey through the Renaissance comes to a close, we find ourselves enriched by the remarkable tapestry of art, culture, and the ideas that defined this extraordinary era. From the grandeur of the Italian courts to the studios of masterful painters, from the intellectual awakening of humanism to the scientific inquiries that would reshape our understanding of the world, the Renaissance has left an indelible mark on history. In this captivating exploration, we've witnessed the brilliance of invention, the eloquence of words, and the enduring legacy of masterpiece. We've delved into the intricate web of politics and power that shaped the period, and we've marveled at the pioneering women who defied convention to leave their own unique imprint on history. The Renaissance reminds us that the human spirit is boundless in its creativity and curiosity, that the pursuit of knowledge and the celebration of beauty are limitless endeavors, and that even in the face of societal constraints, Individuals have the power to challenge norms and redefine what is possible. <laughs>